Hey, what's up, everyone? This is Tommy Two Dimes, uh, and I'm here uh, ripping a brand new product. This is a 2022 Panini Capstone Debut Edition. This is the first off the line. Uh, in this uh, box, we get eight cards per pack, 12 packs per box. Uh, I picked this up on Panini website at the bottom, uh, 120. You get two autos, two mems, uh, ultra fair. Ultra rare blue steel and graffiti. Uh, that's everything you can pull in here. I'm gonna stop and take a picture of it. Uh, yeah, so this is a brand new product. I did see a couple videos, not a ton on YouTube on this. Uh, a lot of people aren't too high on it, but I don't know. You pull a Julio or Wander Auto out of these, I mean, it could be great. <laughs> so, big hits, big hits. Uh, who knows? We'll see how it goes for us. Um, let's see. Obviously, we're looking for Julio Wander. Those, uh, those are the big hits from the box. As always, and here we go. Obviously, there's no this is a Panini product, so you don't have any of the um, the logos. But yeah, no, I still I still find it a cool one. Anyway, for 120, two autos, good chances. You know, okay, first call we got Brandon Marsh, and you can see the. Um, and a lot of people don't like that. I think it's pretty cool, that little rainbow on there. So, Brandon Marsh rookie, a show you Tommy. And I like that it's on thicker cardstock. It is a nice cardstock. So, we got Shohei, we got Marsh, Ryan Pipiot, Shane Clanahan. There's our first parallel. It's Raphael Devers. It's a red. Mookie Betts. This is the other parallel. It's like, uh, I forget what it's called. We'll look it up later. Bryce Lewis. And finish the first pack off with a Kevin Gosman Velo. I'm guessing Velocity. <laughs> so. Little T's not here. He doesn't really normally do the um, baseball rips. So, let's see what we get. Leo Lopez. There's a nice Jeremy Pena rookie. Bryce Alder. Luis Robert. Another Brandon Marsh, rookie red. Kevin Smith, rookie. And there's our first off the line parallel, which is Royce Lewis, seven out of 18, orange parallel. And then a Deja Vu, Roger Clemens, and Jacob DeGrom. Wow, they go both Yankees and Mets on the same card. That's pretty funny. Oh, no. Actually, it says Boston, not Yankees. So. And there you go. There's another guy we like to see. is Bobby Witt Jr. He seems to follow me around, which is pretty good. Romy Gonzalez. Could be worse, right? Marcelo Zuna, red. Alejo Lopez. Looks like some kind of parallel on that one. Luke Williams. Rowdy Telez. And our last... Pretty cool card right here. Jazz, Chis Jazz Chisholm, New Age. Insert. So I haven't had a big hit yet. We're looking, still looking for the two autos, two mems. Um, Glenn Otto, he's a famous uh, autograph signer. Alex Thomas, Adolfo Castro, Kyle Tucker, Seiya Suzuki Red, that's a nice looking card. Wilson Contreras, Joe Perez, and Summit. Nice little card. Summit, Raphael Devers. So you got like uh, seven packs up. I'll try to get a little quicker. Drew Ellis. That looks like our first hit in this pack. Joe Perez again. I'll show you Otani Red. Our first hit, JC. I am, do not know who that is. Gamer Candelario. This is our patch. Yeah, peak. I'm not 100% sure on him. Uh, I'm not a huge Detroit guy. But the enclosed is player one, at least. That's always a positive, right? Freddie Freeman. Taylor McGill, Tyler McGill, sorry. Oh, and then we got a big bang. 
Nicholas Castellanos. So I guess that was the first semi hit. Was this Jamer? Jamer? Okay, here we go. If I butchered that guy's name, I apologize. Jose Ramirez. Alex Manoa. Clayton Kershaw. Ryan Pepiat. And there's our second first off the line. Teoscar Hernandez from the Blue Jays. That's 17 out of 19. Kyle Brandish. Jose Ramirez Gold. And then Alex Bregman Summit. Pretty cool card. So, let's see. So we should still have three more hits. We might we could get them in the last packs, well. Trey Mancini, Fidel Brujan, John Adele, Mike Bauman, Justin Turner, Matt Veerling, rookie, Sean Murphy, and a nice crest Acuna. So still not seen Julio. That's one of those names we're looking for. I mean, I'm good to get it if it comes in an auto. Here we go. It looks like we have a hit in this pack. Rodon, the newest Yankee. Romano, Yon Makata. Shane McClanahan, Red. Here we go. DC. Diego Castilla, Capstone. Auto. That's a pretty cool looking card. I mean, I would have taken uh, you know, Neil Cruz. Would have been a little bit better for me from um, from the Pirates. But I guess beggars can't be choosers. Cedric Mullins. And then a new age Royce Lewis. So we'll get this one sleeved up. Diego Castillo. Pirates fans. Go. Okay, here we go. We got four packs left. Ada Lopez. Jesse Winker. Jazz Chisholm. O'Neill Cruz. There you go. Speak of the devil. O'Neill Cruz comes out. Jose Siri. Shane Bieber. Marcus Simeon. And then Avello Carlos Rodon. So I got two hits left, so hoping for the best, right? Matt Brash, Yoran Alvarez, Jose Miranda, Hunter Green, he's a pretty good guy. Ah, there's a nice Bobby Witt Red, Salvador Perez, Max Scherzer, and then a Velo Dylan Cease. Two packs left. Should have two hits. Another mem and another auto. This looks like our mem right here. Greg Dykeman. Taylor Rogers. Alex Bregman. Pablo Lopez. RC. Ronzi Contreras. That is not a terrible dual patch. Pretty nice. Pretty nice looking patch. Player worn again. Pretty cool. Reed Detmers. TJ Friedel. There we go. We got a Julio. New Age Julio Rodriguez. Nice looking card. Take any Julio Rodriguez you can get nowadays. I mean, his name is pretty hot right now. Contreras, he's a he's a pretty good looking pitcher too. So it all comes down, I guess, to this last pack. Hit a decent auto. If we do, this box is worth it, right? And if we don't, it may not be. Kyle Muller. Brian Buxton. Liam Hendricks. Romy Gonzalez. We'll do the auto last. Garrett Cole. Cool looking card. Brian Reynolds. Big Bang Cody Bellinger. And the last card. Here we go. Can we hit pay dirt? AT. Alec Thomas. 
Capstone Auto, 80 out of 99. So, would have liked a little bit of a bigger name on the two autos, but hey, I mean, we got a Julio, we got a couple parallels of uh, of uh, Bobby uh, Witt Jr. So, I mean, basically, all in all, it wasn't too bad. Probably the card of the box, you know, as always, is Julio Rodriguez. <laughs> So, all right, let me know what you guys think of this product. I mean, like a lot of other videos have said, do we really need another Panini product? Uh, it was a fun rip. Um, so let us know what you think in the comments. Is it worth it for 120? Uh, do these two parallels really make it worth it for a first off the line? Or do you just buy a hobby box? So have a great day. Happy New Year. Uh, hopefully we'll get some more shorts up soon. Thanks.